Good morning. I was thinking about freedom and how every female entrepreneur that I meet is looking for freedom. She might be looking for uh, creative freedom. She wants to have more control over her ideas. She might be looking for location freedom. I have a lot of people who want to be location independent. Time freedom. Most of the women I meet want more time back in their lives to spend with their friends, their families, just their their life. And freedom is a, a high... Um, core value of many, many entrepreneurs. So why do we resist freedom? Well, freedom requires us to make some changes. And I want to tell you that in my very first business, I did not have freedom. I was chained to that business because I didn't know any other way to do it. And in my, all my previous careers as a teacher, as an administrator, all the things I did, I didn't have freedom either because they were jobs where I had to be there at a certain time to a certain time. And I didn't even know I wanted freedom until I got a taste of it. And what I want to teach you is how to have more freedom and why you don't currently have more. Your brain is telling you you want more freedom. Like you might feel it in your soul. You might feel it deep inside of you. But your brain's like, okay, that's going to take a lot of work to get there. And you don't have a lot of time. You already have so much to do. So you're going to keep things as they are. And here's, this is your brain just keeping you safe and efficient. That's what your brain's job is. So if your brain thinks the same thought that it thinks all the time, which is like, this is good enough. You can figure it out. Don't make any changes. It's going to be too much work. That's the efficiency part. Like, yes, keep going, keep going, keep going, be fast. And because it's doing that, it keeps you safe. You already know how to maneuver around it. It might suck, but you know how to maneuver around it. So I want you to understand your brain is not working against you. Your brain is just actually doing its job, keeping you safe and efficient. But if you want freedom, you need to make some changes. So the thing that, that will get you those changes is waking up every morning, knowing exactly what to work on, not spinning around and wasting time. Knowing that these specific items on your list are going to be a good return on your investment. Imagine having systems and help. Those are the things that get us freedom, knowing what we want, being really clear and intentional. Those are the things that get us where we want to go. So why do we resist them? Well, from the women that I talk to, they say things to me like, well, it's summer and I really want to be with my kids. And that's absolutely fantastic. I want you to be with your kids. I want you to work the number of hours that you want to work. I want you to have the life that you want to have. And I also know that you love your business. So you have to put systems into place. You have to put boundaries into place. You have to have clarity. Those are the things that are really hard to do because if, they, if you could have done them, you would have done them already. You can have a business and a life. You just need to know what to prioritize. You need to know how to organize and you need to know how to activate. And those things are hard to do. So if you're looking for freedom, prioritize, organize, and then take action. Those are hard things. And I'll tell you that about 90% of the people out there can do it only with help. 10% can do it on their own. I'm one of the people who needed um, help to do it. I, had, I hired a coach and that's why I am doing what I'm doing. And I realized today I was walking, like look at, the, I'm in North Carolina at my dad's place. And this is the path behind their house. Like there's this beautiful paths. And I realized on my walk, I was like, oh my God, I travel once a month. Like I was really thinking about my months over the past year and I travel every week, once, every month, once a week. And like, that is the freedom that I was looking for. Travel, you know, freedom of location. So freedom is a core value that we tend to tamp down and we tell ourselves a lot of stories. And if you're telling yourself stories about it, like you can't have freedom, it's too much work. Um, I I have been talking to women who are like, I really want to work with you, but I don't know if summer's the right time because my kids and I'm like, summer's exactly the right time because it forces you to put a boundary in place. It gets you what you want. You're going to get more time with your family, more time at the beach, more time at the lake, more time to do whatever it is you want to do, but support will get it there, get you there. So I wanted to just share that with you because don't let the sneaky thought come in like, oh, it's good enough. It's not good enough if you're not happy, 100% happy. It's not good enough if you don't feel the freedom that you want. You know, many people want to like move and have location freedom. And many people want to be able to get up and travel and, and work their business from wherever they do, which is what I do. You don't do that by keeping things the same. So if you're ready to make some changes, also how fabulous is this little tuft of hair right here today? If you're ready to make 
some changes. You might need some support this summer. I promise you, you could have a, su a summer that in 15 minute increments could get you like unrecognizably forward where you, where you would be in the fall would be unrecognizable to you. Like it, it's really amazing what support can do. So I will drop the link to my summer short 90 day program in the links, but I really just did this because I want you to think about what, what kind of freedom do you want? Creative freedom, time freedom, like what other types of freedom are there? And I'd love to know in the, in the comments, what are you looking for? And what's thought is holding you back? And so thanks for showing up today. And I hope you have a great day full of freedom. Bye.